uh, Afghanistan. Uh, we saw Mr. Harper uh, change his position on Afghanistan. Sounds a lot like your wording. Uh, what do you make about that? I wish he would have changed his position a year ago. Would have been in a much better situation today to negotiate with NATO for rotation. But he accepted finally the principle of rotation. He accepted finally the, first, the, the principle that the mission must have the, the clear and firm end date. So I think it, it, it's a progress. You're right. We are pleased by that. We welcome the new motion that is uh, based on the liberal motion. And we'll look at if we need the clarification in amendments and we'll participate in this, uh, in this debate. And above all, we want the change to be operational on the ground in Afghanistan. So now, the date, is, the date is close to your date, but it's still not your date. Is that enough to defeat the Yes, it, it, it is in 2011. Yeah. We were looking for February 2011 to start in the you chose in July completely in July. The government proposed July and to lead in December. Maybe there is a valid reason. It will be part of the debate. En français, s'il vous plaît. Uh, enfin, le premier ministre accepte le principe de rotation. Enfin, le premier ministre accepte le principe que la mission doit avoir une fin et doit se terminer en 2011. Enfin, le premier ministre reconnaît que la mission ne doit pas être que militaire. Elle doit aussi être basée sur le développement, la diplomatie. De la transparence. Et enfin, le Premier ministre se, se met à bouger. On aurait préféré qu'il bouge il y a un an. On aurait été bien plus avancé dans, dans nos négociations avec le temps et le gouvernement afghan. Mais mieux vaut tard que jamais. Quand vous parlez de l'équipe, vous avez une question en tête que vous voulez poser à l'équipe Oui, par exemple, votre collègue vous demande pourquoi le gouvernement a décidé de finir la mission en juillet au lieu de février 2011. It's a question we'll ask. Uh, we go open mind. Maybe the government has a valid reason. We'll, we'll know when we'll have it. So is that something we're willing to move on? If, if they do have a legitimate reason for extending it? Yes. If, uh, look, it's 95% of the liberal motion now. We have some clarifications to ask for. The government accepted the principle of rotation. The government accepted that the mission, the mission must change. The mission must go now to, to our training, uh, development, reconstruction. Uh, security. Uh, the government accepts that the uh, that the uh, NATO must uh, provide troops for battle battle troops. Uh, it's uh, what we were requesting. Now there are some verifications that we need to, uh, to look at uh, about the, some changes, like about the wording of the things. Is that exactly our wording? The government changed. We need to clarify, to clarify what that means, why they did it, because the DT is an important issue. Uh, the same for the end, the firm end date. We need to clarify that. So there are issues that we need to look at. And maybe we'll have to ask for amendments. Uh, but the government moved a lot toward our position. Too bad that they did not do it a year ago. Oh, unfortunately, we have not been able to visit everything we wanted to. But I went to your surgeon lake. I was impressed by the uh, dynamism of the country. Uh, I have seen the uh, Bidens up there, it's incredible. And I will be so much willing to be a strong part of these communities, especially with a strong sport person like John Did you have a chance to talk to your friend? David is a friend of mine. I wish he would be here with us today. Like uh, Mr. Florian is to fight for the for Joan, for the Liberal Party, and for the cause of Canada in all of the things that we believe. We believe in the Kelowna Court, we believe in the Canadian Report. We are all together, we should fight together. Last Thank question, you. now I can still. But did you talk to him at all? Well, I would have been pleased to have talked to him. So he should, should be around to help. We need his help. Okay. We need the help of everyone. Thank you, merci.